guys, Hipsy here and welcome to another video. Um, today we are building a restaurant. Um, I I think I had never built one and I was I wanted to start a new series about um, building restaurants and owning them and making them to be profitable and uh, fancy, you know, like a lot of people would go there. So, um, I decided to create my first restaurant, which it, I think it's going to be called something like Hipside Restaurant or something like that, just to be original. <laughs> so, um, well, as I, I what I just did was to choose the food that we were going to serve and uh, the outfits, the staff of this restaurant is going to work and then um i started i started with this lot which i think is in uh, i think it's in newcrest i'm not really sure but i think it's in newcrest um and it's not a really big lot because i wanted to be i wanted it to be like a tiny well not a tiny restaurant but it's at as a starter restaurant uh, i would say and I I wanted it to be really simple, um, like this. The exterior is super simple. It is just um, one color paint. I think. Well, I think that we are going to change that reddish color and go for more of a blue. I think it's and in the end it's um, a bit blue, and. The ceilings are going to change as well because um, afterwards I decided that I wanted to have like an exterior area with um, with tables and all that, but in the exterior uh, apart from the interior ones. Um, so you're gonna see that change in a while, and I don't know. I, I was I I really wanted to do to do this because. Also, um, I I had never used like the stuff that comes from is it Dine Out? I think it's all from Dine Out, and I it, it is like for real the first time that I'm using everything. Um, so I just at first I just wanted to use stuff from this pack. I think it is mostly stuff from Dine Out, but I'm not I'm not really sure. I think so. Like for the most part, it is um, a dine out thing, or get also um, not get together, but um, the one about working. <laughs> I, I kind of remember the names. Um, so here, as you can see, I am creating the exterior part, which um, I, I think it ended up being really cute like um, having tables outside and there's also a bar and um, see I had to change all the ceilings because uh, it, it didn't make sense at all the way it were um, and yeah I I like that um, here's some fencing because uh, I didn't want people to get into the back part of the restaurant without checking in through the front door and this way I, I like people had to go inside and I, I was I, I got my inspiration for this build from a, a restaurant that are in Spain they are a chain restaurant called uh, Bibs or VIPS in Spain it's called Bips and they have like an exterior area and then also um, food inside and they are similar to a di what Americans would call a diner but they have like a lot of types of food you can have um, you can even I think you can even have some something like Chinese or something and then pizza pasta and uh, also burgers I think salads as well and you can go for breakfast for dinner for lunch for everything that you want they have everything there and I wanted it, I wanted it to be kind of that way like to 
like I wanted Sims to be able to go at any time of day and to be opened at any time of day and that it would be a nice place to go for families um, and so I at first it was going to be kind of a dine uh, a diner but because and you can see right now that I've just placed the kitchens and I I wanted it to be diners or diner types but in the end I use the bowling stuff uh, pack that like the chairs I think all of the chairs are from the uh, bowling stuff pack and um, it ended up being way fancier than I was looking for um, yeah and I, I just went for a really extremely simple bathroom out, uh, like there on the side both for boys and girls together we don't care about that in this um, in this restaurant and the kitchen I think that the kitchen ended up being like pretty big I wasn't expecting to have such a big kitchen but then I thought that if they had interior um, tables and exterior tables there had to be at least two kitchen areas so that um, there were at least two cooks to uh, be able to work as much as they were going to have to work um, so yeah just placing some stuff there um, something for music I I kind of don't like when the restaurants have loud music and you cannot um, talk to the people you are with but like whenever you go to a restaurant and there is some music around like low or I, I love when I go somewhere and there's jazz or um, ambience music so I place those I don't know how you call them the little things for music and um, yeah I know that I thought that maybe they were they were cool for restaurant so here I'm placing bar tables and on the side of restaurant just for because as I said I am getting my inspiration from this uh, VAPS restaurant and they have bars and stalls on the site to maximize the amount of people they are able to give lunch to so I I did the same thing and I went for it as you can see I'm going for those uh, blue um, blue chairs from the bowling stuff which I think they are so cute they are awesome and the exterior is going to be pretty much the same with the same uh, chairs and also this bar stools that I think are so pretty and they look really good on this restaurant and like the food in here is super simple at first I well like I decided to um, go for low quality food just in case anyone wants to use this restaurant as a I would say starter restaurant so I went for low quality food but obviously you can change that if you download it you can download this from the my gallery um, it called Hipsy Hipsy Sims and it's on EA and um, uh, right now where I just place those windows is going to be a door because I I, for, I completely forgot that I needed a door to go outside to the um, exterior uh, lunch area so <laughs> I'm going to take off one of those and just put the door there just decorating a bit right now like the flooring and the walls and I think that rug looks really awesome um, and it goes really good with the wall colors and everything I think in the end it, it all matched really good I don't know let me know if you think I I should have um, used any other colors or if I if you would change anything um, from this build that you can obviously change because you can download it from my gallery and place it wherever you want I think it's not a huge lot um, but also I liked it that way um, because 
as I said, I didn't want it to be too expensive. I'm not really sure about how much it costs. I think, I think it's not really expensive, and you could be able to, if you had a sim um, that has enough money to start a business, um, he's totally going to be able to buy this because it is not expensive at all. Um, but it is also, I think it's also really good decorated, and it is. Um, it is pretty, like, I would like going to this place, I would think that this is, uh, because it's so simple, and, but at the same time, it is, um, cute looking, like, something a girl would decorate, that's totally it, and, I don't know, it is, uh, really simple, but also, like, everything matches really good, and it, it has a great lightning uh, because of all those uh, gigantic windows. And yeah, I think the interior part is almost done. I think I placed some, um, some flowers, decorating tables, but I think it's pretty much it. And so we have started with the exterior area. Um, that I think have very few tables, like four. I think there's just this four. Yeah, and on that uh, corner we're going to build a bar. Um, because I thought that maybe at night it could end being kind of a club, clubish. Like in Spain during summer is really common to have um, what we would call terraces and there on the terrace you can ask for drinks and wait there and also it is really typical right now that restaurants after i don't know maybe 12 p.m 12 a.m would change into um pubs or club well not even clubs because it's not like that but maybe uh pubs and they go for loud music and they and you can order drinks there and I wanted it to be kind of that style, like you would go for a nice dinner and then maybe have some drinks with your friends and on that garden area you could do, you could totally do that because it is like, the, it, I don't know, it's the thing that I would do if I am in Spain during summer. So as you can see I just um, got rid of one of these um, long windows and change it for a door so that people can go through uh, that door to the uh, garden area and then just adding some decorations I wanted to add some uh, picture up there in the wall because it it felt too too empty and um, now I'm going to get some clutter for the kitchen so that it seems that it's lived on and um, just a few stuff like a few things and I think we're pretty much done I think so yeah um, oh yeah we're doing some landscaping first like super simple landscaping I'm changing the color of this um, build because I decided that if the interior was also bluish um, the exterior had to be kind of the same and I wanted to go for a stone exterior and also some bluish uh, paint color. So right now I'm, I think I'm changing it to. I don't. Oh, I didn't change in the end to blue. I don't know if I kept it red and stony. Maybe I did. I would think that it it might have looked better. Um, with a stone and blue exterior but that's fine because the rug also I think I, I, I kept it that way because of the rug inside that looks uh, well that goes with blue and red I think I think that was it and so I I was I, I w struggled a lot to get um, something that would go in that corner uh, in the front corner, I didn't know. I wanted to place um, something like a sign or something like that, but I couldn't find anything that would match that space. 
so in the end I think I went for just yeah some bushes and that was it and I think it looked nice really simple and um, and so I think that we are going to go to the screenshots right now a uh, few of them so yeah almost there <laughs> um, thank you thank you guys for watching and uh, just like subscribe and leave a comment down below and let me know what you want me to uh, do next if you have any ideas for a, another build or maybe a uh, series that you would like to see so let me know and hope you have a great great day uh, see you soon bye bye